Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore back again with another brand new hot sauce review for you guys. Now I've got one that's uh, really interesting. This is one made by Coney Island Saucery for the hit Canadian uh, TV comedy show Trailer Park Boys. And this is the Trailer Park Boys Decent Hot Sauce Limited Edition First Batch. All right, check that out. Well, have you ever heard of the Trailer Park Boys? Uh, I'd never heard of it before. It's a can Canadian uh, comedy. I want to read a little bit about it. It says, Trailer Park Boys is a documentary style, some would say mockumentary style, comedy about the inhabitants of Sunnyvale Trailer Park located in the beautiful maritime province of Nova Scotia, Canada. The show follows the exploits of Sunnyvale's most notorious residents, Ricky, Julian, and Bubbles as they attempt to make money through various greasy and mostly illegal get-rich-quick schemes hotly pursued by the park's drunken supervisor, Jim Leahy, and his shirtless sidekick, Randy. But trailer park life isn't just about liquor and skrilla making cash, right? Ricky, Julian, and Bubbles' friendship and their love for Sunnyvale sees them through their many hilarious misadventures and trips to jail. They've got 11 full seasons, and I believe they're coming out with a, a 12th one is on the way. Now, once again, this is put out by Coney Island Saucery, and I want to read a little bit about them. And it says, Aaron Max Epstein's fondest childhood memories growing up in Brooklyn are of trips to Coney Island with his father and brother where they would indulge in rides and eat raw clams, hot dogs, and frog legs at Nathan's. As a student of graphic design and owner of a hot sauce business, Aaron grew an appreciation for the iconic vintage style and history of Coney Island. It's the love of food and experience merged with the backdrop of Coney Island. A perfect pairing with infinite flavor, combinations of hot sauces to be created. All right, let's check that label out. There they are, Ricky, Julian, and Bubbles. Now, this one's uh, rated um, heat 2 out of 10. And it says here on the back, it says, Coney Allen Saucery crafted the perfect hot sauce for discerning Trailer Park Boys fans. Decent hot sauce is a Louisiana-style garlic-forward hot sauce with a silky texture and the right amount of heat. Made with fresh, all-natural ingredients and made by hot sauce fans for hot sauce fans. It says it pairs well with greasy burgers, chicken fingers, pepperoni, scrambly eggs, or any food you want to make dehiscent. All right, now here's what uh, Ricky said about it. It's actually really effing good. Bubbles said it's scrump dilly. And Julian said, Bubbles, your mom is hot, just saying. All right, and it's got these... Uh, Little icons on here, it says that it is vegan, it is gluten-free, and it is Sam Squanch. Sam Squatch, or however however Bubbles said it, free. Uh, if you watch the show, I guess you'll get that. Coney Island Saucery. All right, let's get into the ingredients on this one, guys. And I'm going to have to read it from my phone because it was kind of tiny. Uh, but uh, this definitely is a Louisiana-style sauce because we start off with a cayenne base, which is aged red cayenne peppers distilled vinegar, salt, xanthan gum. Then we have garlic. And then a vegetable oil blend, palm fruit oil, canola, safflower, flax, and olive oils. Water, natural flavor, pea protein, sunflower, lecithin, lactic acid, annatto extract, color, distilled vinegar, and basil. All right, let's get into this. Sodium listed is um, 100 and 15 milligrams seems a little bit high, but uh, that's kind of what it's going to be with a well, Louisiana style sauce. But uh, the consistency on this one, guys, is um, what you would expect from a Louisiana style sauce. Pepper sauce, hot sauce, however you want to say it. It's nice and fairly thin, but this one definitely is thicker than a completely thin vinegar based. And you can actually see that this is loaded up with some garlic kind of coats the side of the bottle. You can see that there. All right, nice light red color to this one. Okay, let's get into this. Trailer Park Boys Decent Hot Sauce. Now, when I first smelled this, I thought, wow. 
I can smell the garlic. This is loaded up with garlic. So if you are a fan of a Louisiana style cayenne, you get the cayenne pepper aroma, a cayenne vinegar based pepper sauce with extra, extra, extra garlic. Uh, you're going to love this. Yeah, I love the aroma on this one. And I believe you can pick up on hints of the basil kind of at the end. So it's it's got a really nice aroma to it. Once again, upfront vinegary vinegar um, cayenne pepper aroma with garlic. And it's got kind of a, and I think the oil is making it do this. It's got kind of a butteriness to it that smells like this needs to be poured directly on some chicken wings and nothing else. It just smells like that. It reminds me of a delicious cayenne buffalo style um, wing sauce loaded up with garlic. Yeah, this you got to add chicken wings to that list. This smells really good. All right, let me show you what it looks like. Trailer Park Boys. Decent hot sauce. Just what you would expect from this type of sauce. You want a nice thin pour like that, not too thick. All right, here we go. Mm. Ooh. Very simple, straightforward, straight up cayenne pepper flavor. You know, with the saltiness that you would expect from this type of hot sauce, but in a good way. And then just load it up with garlic. And because of that vegetable oil blend, it just gives it a nice silky, uh, smooth richness to it um, that kind of kind of reminds you of a, of a butter sauce. And then the basil at the end just does something. It's a really nice uh, herb that just adds some unique um, tones to this particular hot sauce. It's really, really good. Heat 2 out of 10. Yeah, that's exactly where I would put it. You're just getting the, the regular cayenne pepper heat, but... Great um, Louisiana style cayenne pepper um, sauce flavor. And if you like that type of sauce, but you just love garlic and then you want something a little bit different with the basil and then the oil blend that's in this, uh, this is really, really nice. Definitely really, really good. All right. Uh, let me show you what I did with this one, guys. I knew this would be a good breakfast, probably something that Julie and Ricky and Bubbles would enjoy after a, uh, a drunken um, night of shenanigans. So here's, a, here's what I did. I cooked some sausage, what I call sausage and pimento cheese frambled eggs, not scrambled, frambled, frambled eggs with some roasted, oven roasted red new potatoes and put this all over the top. Oh man, that was fantastic. And if you don't know what frambled eggs are, that's where you, you don't break them in a bowl. You just prepare your pan with some oil or some butter or both. Crack the eggs in there and then slowly start uh, breaking them and, and scrambling them up. And that way you get a nice blend of the white fried part and then the yolks, you know, like a, the yellow scrambled part. That's why it's called frambled. Um, this is delicious, guys, on, on eggs. That would be fantastic on pizza. Like I said, this just screams, pour me uh, on, use me as a wing sauce. Uh, it's that good, guys. Yeah, 2 out of 10 for flavor, but uh, really, uh, 2 out of 10 for heat, but really awesome flavor. I like this a lot. Once again, this is the... Uh, Trailer Park Boys Decent Hot Sauce, made by Coney Island Saucery. All right, got to check this out, guys. I'll put the link in the description, ConeyIslandSaucery.com. Click on it, check out, check it out. That's where you'll be able to order this hot sauce. Aaron, thank you so much for sending it. I do appreciate it. And guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for a lot more, and until the next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.